How's it going guys? It's Scott here at GearRules.com. Today I'm going to be putting out a quick video to show you guys how to change the contrast on this Sunto Core All Black Military Watch. Um, I'm going to be posting a few other videos um, and I'll put them down in the description below on if you want to change the time or just general navigation of this watch. It's a little bit more complex than some other watches. Um, so feel free to click on those videos if there's something else you're hoping to get done. So let's go ahead and dive into it. I just want to put out a warning, though. When you do um, this method to change the contrast, apparently your logs get deleted. So that's just um, something if you recorded a workout or a hike, um, that stuff might get deleted. So... Okay, let's go ahead and dive right into it. It's a pretty easy way, but um, it's not very self-explanatory. So you're gonna hold, press and hold the four outside buttons to put the watch to sleep. You'll see the Sunto logo show and then the face goes completely blank. So now the watch is asleep. So to, to turn it back on, you're gonna hit this fifth button, the one that you did not hit to put it to sleep. And then while doing so, when it's turning on, you're gonna spam the top left button. So you hold this for a second, it starts to load up, and I'm gonna spam just this top left button. Sometimes you gotta hit the original button as well. And just keep pressing it. All right, so we get to this screen. Um, once you see version you, in contrast, you know you've done it right. Sometimes when turning back on, if you don't spam this top button, you'll see, uh, I think it shows up as language. That, no, that, that means you've done it wrong and you'll have to start over, um, get back to the time screen and then start, start over from this video. So to get down to contrast, you hit the bottom right button to go down to contrast. And then you're going to hit this middle button right here to select contrast. Now the contrast will range from one to 15. The higher up you go, the more of the background that starts showing up in the display. So to go up, you do this top right button and to go down, you do the bottom right button. So we're gonna go all the way up to the max, just to show you guys what it looks like. It does not look very good. You can see the background starts to really bleed into the image. You can see there's all the images that might light up are up here. So I don't typically go that high. I usually stick around 10. And I think 10 is a sweet spot and you know, between nine and 11. But if you go all the way down, obviously the display gets very, very light. So I'm gonna bump, beef it up back to, you know, around 10. And yeah, that's how you do it once you're finished. I believe you just hit this top left button. Nope. Yep, you hit the, the middle button right here and exit out of it with the top left button and you're back to your time. So that is how you change the contrast. Like I said, it's, it's pretty easy, but definitely not self-explanatory. Um, so yeah, if you guys need help with any other features on this watch, um, look in the, the bio below. And uh, if you guys like this content want to see more stuff on gear, um, please subscribe. So thank you for watching. Have a good day.